I actually come up here my 18th birthday. Where'd you stab him? Uh, abdominal area, neck, legs. I don't know, I would have been in a punk there as long. I can't, I can't remember stabbing him. I can't remember putting a knife in him at all. The only car do I ever done is on the web in place, to be honest with you. Come on down, set him in place. Same shit every single day. I've actually talked to drugs in here that I would never have been near it. So how come you can behave yourself in here and not out there? That's a good question. <laughs> I don't know. in Northern Ireland houses young offenders and some who are awaiting trial. Today we're conducting a targeted search. We are looking for a small knife which has gone missing from uh, the prison kitchen. Our population is not used to this level of lockdown um, or restriction. They are out and about from uh, 8 o'clock in the morning right through to 7 o'clock at night. Most of these inmates are aged between 18 to 21. Every now and again you need to get a wee bit of this is what we can do when we need to do it, you know. Their offences range from theft to murder. It's us. With most prisoners arriving with some form of drug or alcohol problem. We're also looking for, for anything else that may be present, you know, other drugs. Look here, look, he's relieving that man. He's not that good, I think. Prison staff struggle to stop drug abuse becoming as common on the inside as it is on the outside. What? Super screws like. Me and your man are saying I'm staying in my room. Me and the fucking rocket. When a kid's learning across the window in a coffin after taking illegal drugs or overdose on prescription drugs, which is just as bad, they're the victim of a death dealer. So they have a need to go after drug death dealers, drug dealers. Time and then move on. My name's Stephen Nolan, and as a local broadcaster, I hear callers regularly express concerns that increasing drug use is behind more and more crime. What all needs clean hair, me fuck sick. That's because it's late. A long oh, age. Your long age, you had to like blow in the way tube tells you what age you are in your lungs. I don't believe mine is 38, like, can't be. Can't be, fuck that. Go for a smoke or what? They have only 10 months left or something. You have a whole sentence today, like. 17 months to go. Then I have that. four months. I stay away from the drugs and I get out. I said keep the head there. You know what? Try to, like, I've spoken about a grass probably, but I won't be taking ease or not. Like, see if I took ease the way I used to, see if we took drugs the way we used to take drugs. See if I took drugs the way I'd, I'd be found dead somewhere. See once you get out, yeah. you're tall. You're pure and clean. You know what? You haven't been around See anything. the first week in here? Fuck me, that's. You sweat, sweat, sweat. Sweating all the drugs out of you. Sweat all the drugs out of you. It's fucking mad. Your head be wrecked, too. See, going cold turkey when you come in oh. here. Bad Not having none. But it's a good old feeling when you are clean, you know, yeah. you haven't done any, you're passing them drug tests. No it's what? a good old feeling. Random drug tests hope to catch prisoners who will try anything to get drugs inside. Yes, the right, so we'll come in, stand there, get a full search. They'll just basically go into the toilet, get there, and it's pee, bring it back out, and then have start the actual test. I've actually talked drugs in here that I would never have been near it. Oh, I'll try my first DD and all of here. Try my cook in here. Try my butts in here. Fuck me, I'll try it all. Something on? No, I saw it. Substitute for her when I sniffed that flower. I didn't know what something like that was. Oh, like, the material. Neither did I. Why do you get red carded? Trying to fuck about my room? Mm -hmm. 
Fuck's sake. What is a fucking ball? It's a bottle of pee ball to smoke drugs for you. That's what pee gets good. They're, they're, used, they're used for drug consumption. Like. They get the bottles you use but the drugs are always on you. But if you've got a seat, they're never going to fail. You can't squat and eat on the fender because we're not able to touch you now. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, don't you have the flavors? I have to get stuff in. <laughs> <laughs> you get up after you relax your muscles. That's it. What? You have to flavor yourself, don't you? If you want to get stuff in. Ah, you're fucking head. It's not a way, like. Leave it on here too long. It's not a way, like. Very camera and pop bubble box. <laughs> See the last time I was in the what they say? had to be put up in the hole like the make, make it bigger so you can get stuff like <laughs> so air. Obviously it's a dirty way of doing stuff, you know what I mean? But no, it's not as if we're fucking snorting shit around. You know what I mean? <laughs> Stop back then. You sure? I'm gonna roll up to your back. Sweet. See, see what you want me to fight, sir? What? Calm! Yeah. Show me how to roll up, buddy. Yeah. Give him a hand, son. Yes, give him a hand. You ever want to light it? <coughs> you don't need to like, talk once a week. If you buy 20 fags. He's gonna want one, he's gonna want one, he's gonna want one, he's gonna want one, and the whole land's gonna want one. By that time, the book's five faced yourself. So, you buy pitch of tobacco, does you a full week. If you're on basic, you get to spend £29. If you're standard, it's £49 and enhanced £89. I have a, st I have a standard there. £49 quite a week. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. In return for good behaviour and passing drug tests, prisoners can be rewarded with privileges. The most enhanced area of Hyde Bank, Willow House. Moving over to Willow. Hi, me and Pretty. You're not locked at all. You get to like leave the co college for an hour a day, like just like a proper open gym. You just live in your life, but then you know what I mean, living like a king in you. Yeah. <laughs> all right, mess. I'm away here. Thanks very much, right? Thank you. Don't mess it up. No. All right. Do I say it right? Yes. All right, Joe, take it easy, mate. Well, that's all right, we're going to All brownies, all this, all brownies. They're even given a key to the prison gate. Obviously, we don't get to use the gym inside no more. We have to go, go outside, so we're doing it. So, no, it's something different, man. Get my fitness up, do a wee run on it. I need to get my pens. I don't know what box they're I need to ask him where he put my big box. My fucker is in front of me. I hear you can put these up too, Myth. Saves me, saves me climbing, man. What do you want? Right in the middle. Here? No, up. Up, up. That's not in the middle left. Right. That's, that's sweet. Um, where, am I, where am I putting this here? The keys? Oh, I was over the ball when they were working out, you know? I was supposed to go back at night. But then, just went for a party. Then come back and throw a week later, you know. Bad behaviour and drug taking can lose them this enhanced status and other privileges. I went to enhance once for a week. And they dropped me. Fucking about. Torture and Scrooge for good. They just dropped me. Keep them going, they don't like it. Say certain things to them, they crack up. And then you know what cracks them up, so you keep saying it and saying it and saying it. Don't want to say on camera. Bad things like. Random drug tests are used to ensure a prisoner stays clean. 
He goes, they, they proper put my hair away. So that uh, coming in here has actually helped me out a lot. So it has. There's two ways you can go. You can either get your head on straight, or you can do what other boys do: mock about, take drugs, be in the black. So there, there's two. There's two passes. Just whatever one you want to go. What did you do? I took him um, Sanex. You sk just skipped day, so we did, took ten on, and me and her were fighting so over. We and our neighbour came in to either calm me down or stop it or help her, whatever it was. And bit him a couple of times to get him off me and then when that didn't work, I produced the knife. Where'd you stab him? Uh abdominal area, neck, legs. I don't know, I would have been on a punk there as long. I can't, I can't remember stabbing him. I can't remember putting the knife in him at all. Uh, I remember the police catching me in the back garden. I was hiding in the bushes. And then I remember getting drove up the high bank. After a couple of days, you sober up a wee bit and you're told sort of what you're in for. You ring your solicitor and stuff and you have no idea. Couldn't even remember my police had their fuse open. Here, these men are a real wee fair girl. No, no, you weren't right. sweet. No problem. If I wasn't on drugs, that wouldn't have happened. That's why I've got so far in here. I'm not on drugs now. There's a chance to go clean in here. Alright, I've done it. Mm. Done it nearly a year now. Yeah. He says he couldn't make out your hand, right? So he's going to send you up another six packets of those in order to be bottled down. Why? Glenn's full of my head full of shit. I am going to pity you to speak to him. No, you're not the red card. Well, then you're escorting me. You don't walk around this place as the way you want to. If you're a red card, you get escorted. And the appointments I got, they come to see you. Or they tell me I need him up here at this time. Sorry, after the day. Sorry, after the day. Oh, what? Oh, he takes a job to shoot his hand up. Man, he needs a He hangs his nails all along. He's a fucking brilliant head. You shouldn't have seen my hand, I mean, like that, though. Because you refused to lock, you know? I mean, but don't relax me for no reason, because Josh called me shitty and said I was shitty again, I'm done. Did you get locked for that? Yes. Yes. You're not in jail, you're not in the five star hotel. Oh, true. You're not in the mercy. Yeah. Hey, I'm Versi. Come on, Versi. Come on, Stevie. No, if you got an upper, she won't come off it like in a week. No, I don't. Somebody about 20 years old, let me tell you what they and ordering you about and clean the area and do this here and do that here and You feel like fucking throttle. Do you know what I mean? What's she you feel like they're to kill? We're just gonna get you. No fucking year. I don't know yourself, you know what I mean? You're the baby tongue. Walk on, smile, noisy. Get rid of it. What? Behind the ear. Oh, I forgot that was there. See the way he talked in here? He wouldn't talk that way in the other side of that gate. I don't know if only the screws is talking to me the way they talk to me in here. You know what I mean? See some men, cheeky bastards. Did you get into trouble with them? No, I'm enhanced. I'm a good boy. So how come you can behave yourself in here and not out there? That's a good question. <laughs> I don't know. You need to lift your driving license for the two months today. Uh, it's Mr. Wilson. I'm seven. Yeah. That's all my money, you know, my beef, space feeders, my caramel wafers, chocolate bourbons, there's all. 
I don't know. You actually have a good wee month to spend. I know where I'm coming later after the gym. Our Nissan fucking Chinese beef noodles. They're the cheapest ones, so I go for them like fucking 30 p or something. A black market system runs inside the prison. This system has its own unique exchange rate. That's the way you get your answers. You trade this for drugs. Like a full one am in the box, all open for a fuck it. Just there now. Alright. Well, how can I show you? Do you want me to just whip a fuck it out and show him? No, you don't have a fuck it. Let me show you. Like that much of dope, right? Yeah. For, like that. That's how much you would pay for that, we will. I know, I know. It's mad. It is alright. See all this here stuff, this is money in here. He would owe me probably 14 of them, because they're a pound a can, and an ounce is 14.50. <laughs> I, I know someone who made 10 ounces in one week of like a 25 bit of dope on the streets outside, and that's what's 10 14s, that's 140 odd quid there. He's just more like. And so, but you don't want 10 tens of rice, do you? No. Nah. You, no, you just give them a top of the stuff what they have to get you, and if you don't get it, you're getting battered. Tell me what you mean. Battered, you're getting your bags kicked in the next morning if you don't have it for whatever day you say you have it for. Well, if you don't have what? Right, say I, I, so I give him a fucker rent for an ounce rent. Say if he didn't get that ounce for me, I would come in when he, if, say he was late with a by like three days, I would come in here and bit the head off him and tell me what he was for. It's just the way jail is. One ten of rice to myself, so the, all them races aren't mine. I pinched one the other day. I know you fucking did, you wanker. Who's your other? Our wee washies. I own them. But Why do you own them? Because I, like I bought something. Just a wee bit of tobacco, just. The steel is wild. It is right. It's a hard knock life for us. I don't sit in the house of all mate. Serious, screw cunt. So you've been sentenced, I believe? Yeah, two and a half years, the 15 and 59. What was the crime? I, uh, I have no Drug idea. Charges, yes. Taken or dealing? Dealing. Yeah. mistake, like. How, like, how do you become a drug dealer? I don't know, just somebody had it there and like, offered me, and then I just said, aye, without thinking about it. I don't agree with it, like, I was just stuck for money, you know. And that was my easy option. Regret it back time now, look. What type of drugs? Okay. Cocaine and grass. That was my first conviction, look, and I got that there time for it. How much are we making? Enough. <laughs> like hundreds a week? Like, what's the incentive? Thousands a week? What about? Not thousands, I know, look, but not the hundreds. Do you think you'll be back in? No, definitely not. Everybody says that? I know they do, but I know, but look. I learned my lesson the first month or two I came in here. But it's not for me, look. I'm a family man. I haven't wanted to be allowed to hear the rest of my life. I thought I was invincible. It turns out I'm not. <laughs> Hello. What time does Ben, what time is PDU opening? PDU? PDU next week, Glenn to make sure my grant's definitely there. I've done, served 14 days I'm sentenced. Like, and I've filled it in, but I want to make sure that it's there. Uh, I'll get them around here, but they want me. That's right. Here you go.
I used to get 1800 pound a month and everybody else used to go on cocaine, ecstasy and cannabis. Why would I work a full time job whenever on benefits I'm earning 365 pound more? Sit on my ass. Because apparently I'm not right up there. Why would a crazy mama go, yeah, take that 365 quid off me and I'll work full time? Yes, it keeps your mind straight and it keeps you happy and it keeps you keeps you normal. But why? Why would you cut yourself that, that amount of money? That's possibly £150 worth of shopping, a new phone, Netflix contract, TV and everything else you need. And still money left over to go out and out in the weekends and do this and do that. See benefits in government. See half the people that are on it, they're funding their drug habits. Right, I need to get back to work. I need my gloves. Oh, no, I'm eager to roll him out. Oh, God. How's your home leave? Sweet ass. Give her a pump for me to do. Give her a pump for me to do. Give her one for me, you know. Jesus. I was out in home leave, day release, sort of thing. But I've been in here for 12 months today, so it was strange getting out, see, seeing all the cars and buildings and all this. <laughs> Sounds stupid like, but it was weird, so it was. I saw near you, I imagine where I'm going to be like, weird. I know you, but it was good, lads. Straight to a psych ward. Freaking out there, come back past the dog, no? just because you know what it's like, you know what I mean? Yeah. With the drunk dog and the breathalyzer and the drug test. Pass them all, I can pass them all. Sometimes it goes back to the front, but they're all good. You should have heard them last night. I could imagine. Uh, they were yeah. whole bang in the doors, like bang two, three doors, four, five, 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 like the cannabis and all I guess. The officers and all they go mad and just laugh everybody like but they don't really care. It was a mad problem with that spice stuff, I heard about oh, people know. running about like zombies and everything man. Huh? I trying to speak the screws but the only thing they could come up with was <laughs> people wobbling behind them. I mean it's madness. People like on walls and all? I like on walls and all. But I like Emmer's on accent here, people's tolerance be real low for them and they, they take, think they can eat loads. They take like half of one and be <coughs> trying to bait each other and all and smash some windows and just being like idiots. run about like something possessed, like it's crazy. <laughs> so it is crazy, like the people would actually be surprised. I was surprised. I was surprised when I came in. I didn't think I'd be no bad about no nothing and before you knew where there was people offering me left, right and centre, like you know what I mean? Yeah. Madness. But then, uh, like he said, there's loads of times where <laughs> <laughs> there's loads of times where you can't get enough in. But then, <laughs> all of a sudden, you got about twelve people asking you if you're after any. I mean, it's it's madness. It's madness. Sorry, right, it's good if you're if that's what you're into. Like, yeah, yeah. We've nothing to lose. Like, what I mean. That's me, he wouldn't have been too old now. And he's brilliant, so he is. And he's grown up without a dad at the minute. At the start of his life, I was all right. I was working on a college, a wee job and all, but when me and his mummy broke up, I was a waste there. I couldn't cope. And that's, <laughs> you'll, be, you'll be told straight, so you uh, met another girl, so I did. We only loved each other when we're on some, <laughs> but I'd love you if I was on some. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the way, just the way they make you. They actually give me a course of diazepam on here. I, I told the nurse, and I don't want that no more. She was shocked. She says, probably the first person ever in here to refuse my diazepam. Just didn't want drugs to be, or I didn't want to need help with, from drugs, you know what I mean? I wanted to do it by myself. Mm. And uh, that's helped me a lot, so it has. Some of them just can't get off them. And I, I do have a sympathy for them, because I used to be like that. I've changed, and I'm going to keep changing for the better. I'm not going back.
man's are one. <laughs> you guys out there supposed to help you with his horses, though? Yeah, I'm out of the pool. Oh, I'm out of the pool. Mm -hmm. I told you you don't work here no more, Hannah. Can't get enough of you, you see? She was in nine months and then I got out for three weeks. So I was. Whoa. I feel, I feel off my head on my medication and me. I feel proper off my rocker, so the. Vlog rug, you know. Did you clean that window cell earlier, yeah? Oh, I made them. I didn't sleep last night just. It's about the Scarface. It's a good family. One of the other guys was saying there that uh, some of the guys I've spoken to before have been moved away. Yeah, back house, like. Don't know what What's happened back there. house mean? Put back to the land that you were on before. You really look one Oh, so off enhanced? Yeah. Uh, Um, to do the test, he said he's going to feel anyway, so he's on back to the house. Well, I'm supposed to be one pairing. Well, I did. I'm just leaving all the smoke for now. Right. Lad. I'm going to hand first. Oh, I'm going to hand. I'm going to hand. I'm going to hand. I'm going to hand. I heard uh, Curtis, they feel like they dropped the back house again in the beach. Soft plan, I mean. I make our own decisions, like. Young Curtis, um, he's had a little bit of a slip. It's disappointing for him, disappointing for us. Something happened when we went out with the child. Same shit every day, I'm here, like, the same shit. Thank you, The same people. Call me Shane, you know. We had the gym, they had the weight, they were squatting down. We were, uh, uh, sharded, you know what I mean?